I'd like to make this a movement of change and to change people's attitudes about how we think about sex and how we talk about sex and what's important in terms of intimacy. I'm Lori Beth Bisbee. I am by training a clinical psychologist. I am also a qualified coach. I grew up on the East Coast of the United States, um, went from New York, New Jersey, up to Boston, Massachusetts, then went from there to North Carolina, North Carolina to California, and after being in Southern California for six years, met my first husband and ended up in the United Kingdom. For me, my journey to this place is very much one of a journey through different cultures, um, along with different challenges and different stages in life. And in everything that I have done, what I find most compelling is connection to other human beings. That's what I believe the purpose of life is, is connection to other human beings. And over the years, I've worked at becoming authentically me. That's been a very important piece for me because that when, you're, when you are authentically yourself and you're living as authentically as possible, that is when you can make really good, solid, authentic connection. It's my view, you cannot be intimacy with others, have intimacy with others until you actually have some intimacy with yourself. So that requires self-knowledge and it requires the ability to continuously reflect and learn from your experience, both inner and outer, and your interactions with the world. So um, I started out with a focus on trauma. Some of that came from my own history. Um, and so I started out focusing on um, the things that create post-traumatic stress disorder and what one could do to resolve post-traumatic stress disorder. I was uh, trained clinically, so I spent a lot of time um, working with people doing psychotherapy, and I worked a lot with children um, and families. Um, and then I looked, worked a lot with adults who were traumatized. I went from there to look at um, gender and sexuality and um, how gender and sexuality impacted um, people's daily lives and interactions and relationships. So that was an area I spent um, some time within training and some time with after training, um, but then um, came back to in more recent years and spending more, much more time focusing on working with a really diverse group of people. Um, so from all gender identifications and all sexuality identifications, I work with um, polyamorous groups, um, so people who have multiple relationships at the same time. I've worked with polygamous families, so um, where it's been um, one husband and um, a multiple wives, gay, straight, bisexual, transgender, transsexual, the whole wide range.